Good day, everybody. Um, here's our volcano documentary. Um, we are going to be talking about one of the world's most dangerous creations, volcanoes. I'm going to hand it over to Ryan. Here he is. Well, hello there, Mark. Now, today, we're going to be talking to you about one of nature's most dangerous creations, volcanoes, Mark. Now, before I hand it over to my mites, I'm quickly just going to brief you all on volcanoes. Now, volcanoes are basically openings in the earth that allow hot lava, volcanic ash, and even poisonous gas to escape. Now, they're obviously really dangerous. Now, volcanoes are formed when two tectonic plates collide, and one plate goes over the other. Now, at the same time, these volcanic plates open and they move away from each other. Okay, now, I'm quickly going to hand it off to Noah, but this isn't the last you'll see me. Bye. Okay. So you might be asking yourself, are there different types of volcanoes? Well, yes, there are. There's actually three different types of volcanoes. The first type of volcanoes are active volcanoes. Active volcanoes are volcanoes that have erupted in the last thousand years and are either about to erupt or are erupting. They also show signs of lava and ash. Dormant volcanoes are volcanoes that haven't erupted in the last few thousand years but are expected to erupt in the next couple of thousand years. And the last type of volcanoes are extinct volcanoes. Extinct volcanoes are volcanoes that have not had an eruption in the last thousand years and isn't expecting to erupt in the next few thousand years. They also aren't showing any signs of erupting. Okay, that's for me. Let me hand it over to Adam. Well then, hello there, Mark. Now, I'm coming back because I will have to show you the cross section of a volcano. Now, you can easily see right about there is a third of a volcano, or as we like to say, the vent. Now, you can see everything of a volcano. The magma chamber, which is round about down there, the lava flow, and all of that stuff. Well, hope you enjoyed this fun documentary. I'll see you later. Today, I will talk to you about the positive and negative effects of volcano. Number one, some volcanic areas become tourist attractions and generate income. Two, volcanic lava often contains valuable minerals like diamonds. 3. Volcanic ash can act as fertilizer in tropical regions. 4. Underground water is often very hot and can be used for electricity or heat. Here are some of the negative effects of volcanoes. Water supplies can be polluted. Lava burns and buries vegetation. The ash covers the town. Mud flows covering low-lying areas, killing all living things. The shower of volcanic bombs and ash are very dangerous. People's health can suffer breathing in ash and poisonous fumes. The Ring of Fire is a ring of volcanoes located in the Pacific Ocean. 90% of all earthquakes and 81% of all the big earthquakes happen here. According to Wikipedia, more than 75% of the world's active and dormant volcanoes happen there. Volcanoes formed by hotspots divergent plate boundaries and convergent plate boundaries. Thank you.